Alrighty, welcome back to episode 3 of the Planet Crafter. On our last episode, we got some plants going, so we have lots of oxygen generating. And uh, we have this small heater. Our goal for today was to at least get some more heat going. Now, um, if we look at our blueprints over here, we have a few unlocked. I've been kind of sitting AFK here in my base. So now we have our backpack tier 3, so we can upgrade our backpack, get more um, inventory spaces. We have a two-person bed, which we're not really worried about decorating just yet. And then we have solar panel tier 2 already. So this will provide us even more power. We're going to work on that. And then down here, we unlock the oxygen tank tier 3. That, of course, increases our oxygen. And then we also have this communication antenna, which I don't really know what it does. It says it receives transmissions from outer space using combination with the transmission screen. So we're going to make the uh, transmission screen first, which is right here. We need one iron and two silicon. I did organize my chest on the uh, last episode. So um, hopefully the screen's not too big because I don't have much space on my table here. Let's go ahead and pull. Okay. It's going to kind of block that middle. I don't know. It'll be fine. I mean, I can kind of still see. We'll just put it there. It's not exactly in the middle because these are two separate tables. And uh, yeah, that looks good. Okay, so now we need a communication. Oh, wow, it's expensive. Two silicon, two titanium, and two iron. So we've got two of those. Two titanium, um, two silicon, and the last item was aluminum. We actually have a couple of those, I believe. Yes. Okay, so let's go outside and put our antenna down. I'm not sure how big it's gonna be. It's pretty, it's pretty large. We're just gonna stick it up here at the highest point. Not that it matters. Oh, wow, that takes a lot of energy. Holy cow. It takes 15. Okay, we're gonna have to upgrade. Let's see, we have the tier two solar panels. It needs, wow, these, these engrams, like the blueprints, are getting super expensive now. <laughs> Alright, so for one, we need magnesium. Pretty much one of everything. We need one of these. One of these. I think two of those. A couple of these. And one aluminum. Sweet. Alright, let's go out there and see how big this solar panel is going to be compared to these. I thought these right here were pretty awesome to begin with, but now we're upgrading even further. Oh yeah. That is, that's awesome. There we go. Now these, the tier 1 has 6.50 kilowatts, and this is 19.50. That's three times. This is three times just one of these. That is insane. Alright, we're just going to leave it at that. Now let's go take a look over here at this antenna. Uh, no information other than it uses 15. Okay, so that takes so much energy. Holy cow. Now let's go look at our screen and see what's up with that. No communication antenna in rain. Oh, it has to be super close. Maybe I can put it on top of my house. Maybe I should have put the screen out here. I don't know. I'm going to deconstruct that and we're going to see if we can just like put it out here for now. It's going to look kind of funky. Can I put it on the roof? Maybe if I had some stairs to get up there or a ladder. You know what? We're just going to we're going to put it right there for now. We can always move it later. Now let's take a look. All right, this is an automated message to Convic. You choose to commute your sentence into an extradition. If you want to be released of all your charges pending against you, you'll have to fully terraform this. Pl oh my gosh, we're a convict. <laughs> this doesn't really sound like a punishment. I mean, this is a nice little adventure. You'll have to fully terraform this planet. Our sensors will periodically scan your progress and will send you the required blueprints. Do not try to contact Sentinel Corp in any case. If our sensors do not detect any advancement on the terraformation process, you'll be considered missing. The charges won't be dropped. You cannot claim property or value over anything on the planet. What? You are only allowed to use the resources found on the planet to increase the terraformation index. You are not allowed to leave this planet until the terraformation is complete. Wow. 
I had no idea that there's like there's like a little bit of a story element to the game. That's super cool. So we are a convict sent to pretty much make this planet in working order. What kind of things could I have done to take me to such drastic measures of, you know, like completely rebuilding a planet? That's insane. All right, well, we got that going. Uh, oh, heater, this is what we need. Two iridium, titanium. Okay, so we need, I think, th we're just gonna grab a couple of these. And then we need iridium. And I think I saw aluminum in there. Uh, here it is. Okay. We need to go put this somewhere. I'm gonna put it out here by my drawer. Oh, you have to put it inside. Okay. Okay, I don't really have space for it. That's not good. Oh, man. I guess I'll put it in here for now. Uh, we'll put it... We'll put it right... There. You know, and the, the heat actually progresses something. What does it progress? Again, right here. And we don't have very many blueprints. And I want to get the biodome. Dome! Biodome. The biodome. And so I'm going to craft another one of those. Because this thing here only generates 0.30. And then this big one here generates 4.50. So yeah, we need to craft another one of those. Iridium and silicon. Grab a couple of those. And some of that. Do we have enough now? Aluminum. And one of these. Okay, so let's get another one of those. Perfect. And do we have enough to make even another? I think we do. It's gonna go take away all of my resources. And then two iridium thing. This stuff's pretty hard to get, or at least I've only found a couple of them. And then we're just gonna throw this here because we are gonna move it later. So we'll put that there. Oh, we need more power. Of course. Of course. Two cobalt, magnesium. Um, this. We have cobalt right here. And then we need aluminum and silicon. There we go. Let's go put another another solar panel out here. This thing's so massive. I don't even think this is the final upgrade for it either. I think there's more. There we go. Now everything is powered. We are running again. Let's go look at our screen that shows all of the electricity usage. Oh, so we still have 16.20 available. We are consuming 48 now, jeez. Oh, we unlocked a new screen. It is the progress. Displays your progress on the different ter terraformation state. Ah, oh, I want to have that. I should have skewed this over. All right, let's do that. Let's see if we can fit four of them on here. We'll just put one on each section. That one, and then we need iron, silicon. A lot of crafting in this game. And it needs one cobalt. All right. Here. I love all the upgrades. This game has so many. Holy cow, it's a massive screen. Oh, jeez. Can we put it right here? Wow, that's huge. Where do I even stick it at? Can we really not put it above chest? Oh yeah, we can. Okay, I'm gonna put it right here. There we go. Current stage is barren, and next stage is blue sky at 13%. We're at 13%. So I guess once we increase our terraformation, it's at the very top right of the screen there. We're at 23, is that how it works? So I guess once this gets to 100%, we'll have blue skies, because right now it's... Oh, it is... Maybe not. It's kind of looking the same as when I started the game. Maybe a lightly changed of color. It used to be like super orange. Very cool. So many upgrades. Jeez, all right. 
Um, I think we crafted everything new that we can except for our new backpack and oxygen. So we're going to upgrade our backpack first. We need two aluminum, titanium, and silicon. Oh, that's our last bit of aluminum. And then... Uh, oh gosh, I don't think I have enough. We gotta run back. Let's see. Let's see here. And then a titanium. Problem is, once I take this bat pack off... I think it's gonna drop all my stuff. Okay, I have enough. Wait a second. Wait a second. Oh my gosh, I already had the tier 3 backpack? Okay, it's the oxygen tier 3. Okay, I got it, I got it. I mean, well, that's good. That's less resources we have to use. I thought I... I didn't know I crafted that. That's awesome. That's actually fantastic. Okay. So next, we have to craft this oxygen tier 2. We're going to take that off. Go in here and craft tier 3. And now we're going to equip that. And now our oxygen capacity is 280. It's kind of hard to see. I don't know why they used the font. They made it white along with the background is already white. They need to fix that. Change it to orange or something. Alright, so I think we have progressed as far as we can for now. Let's see. What is this? Add a compass to your screen? Uh, we don't really need that. At least I don't think we do. So yeah, now it's pretty much just a waiting game, which means we can go out and explore. So let's grab some uh, food. Put this aluminum up. I really need some ice to get some water. Ah, uh, it's like a sandstorm. I need one piece of ice. Otherwise, this adventure is going to be very short-lived. Alright, I see a piece. Get this. Oh, we uh, unlocked the uh, food grower. The next one. Let's go craft that. That way, while we're out and exploring, um, we're producing a lot more oxygen. Very exciting. Man, I do not like this storm. If we even have any materials to craft it. Alright, we craft it in our inventory. One aluminum, a water bottle, and iron. Okay. Get a couple of these. And we only have one aluminum left. Well, we didn't make it. Oh, yikes, this thing's really big. All right, let's put it in this room over here. And then we're going to put our best plant in there, which I think might be this one. No, that's 150. That one has nothing. This one right here. This is our best one. And we're going to deconstruct that and get those resources back. And we're going to put it in here. Wait, I can't put that in there? Let's see. Energy is 15. Chance to get seeds back when... Oh! Oh my gosh! This is a food grower! Oh, I see. I see. Wow. Okay, I read that wrong. Um, Where's our seeds? This is fantastic. Now we can actually grow some food. You put these in there. Okay, so now we are growing some beans. It looks like a little caterpillar, kinda. I don't know how long it takes. Chance to get seeds back 100%. Growth is at 31%. Kinda wanna know if it's gonna change. Okay. Well, that's good to know. Um, I need to recraft my veggie tube and put this little guy back in there. Sorry about that. Alright. Cool! 
So I think that just produces us some space food. These, yeah, this right here. So I don't really use that half the time. I just let my character kind of pass out and teleport back here because it doesn't seem like there's any consequences to doing that. All right, we have water, it's food, and we are ready to go explore. We already went to that ship over there last time, so this time we are gonna go this direction. I see these really weird rocks, so I wanna head over there and see what's up with that. We're kind of running out of uh, resources near our base because we've harvested everything. So I'm afraid if there's no like fast movement in the game or vehicles or anything like that, then it's going to be really rough if we have to keep walking super far and explore. But this place looks kind of dangerous. I know there's no enemies. It's more of just survival elements, but I feel like this place would be very hostile. Let's see what's over here. I want to pick this stuff up, but... Oh, what's this? I have not seen this yet. Oh, it's aluminum. Heck yeah. Is there any more? Oh, there's one over there. Oh, okay. So this is like the aluminum uh, field. Very cool. I bet each little section has like, this probably has aluminum. A section over there or over there probably has the uh, magne- or not magnesium, the iridium. That's gotta be what's go- oh, a ship. I deconstruct this? Nope. Nope. Not deconstruct. There's stuff inside. How do I get inside there? What? Seriously, how do I get in there? Oh, I have to climb up. Okay. Can I deconstruct? <laughs> oh, this is so cool. We have aluminum, iridium, iron. I don't really need the space. Oh, what's this? Uranium? Wow, we have not seen that yet. All right, let's deconstruct. Is there anything else? It doesn't look like it. Oh, it was trying to deconstruct the chest inside. Use my oxygen so I can explore a little more, even though my inventory is almost full. Why can I not? Oh, okay. I got it, I got it. There we go. Grab as much aluminum as I can, because we are, like, out of it. Is there any chests around here? Kind of excited about that uranium. That's probably super end game loot. All right, I think we might just head back now. Oh, I see a chest over here. I won't be able to carry everything, but I do want to see if there's any like uranium in there and at least grab that and then we'll head back. Oh, there's another structure over there. All right, we got to check that out, too. There's so much cool stuff out here. Am I crazy? I thought I saw a box. Oh, there it is. I just went past it. And we just unlocked our exoskeleton tier two. Yes. Um, Nothing too crazy. We're going to leave that for now. I want to see what the structure is. See if there's any goodies inside. And more over there? This is probably nothing. You probably can't even do anything with it. Can't deconstruct it. Can I not even go inside it? What's the point? Alright. We well, can't do anything with that. What's down here? We're just getting further and further. We're almost out of oxygen. I kind of like it though. When you run out of oxygen, it just teleports you back to your ship. Instead of having to walk all the way back. So I'm fine with that. Agility boost? Increase displacement see Oh, heck yeah. And then we got food. Oh, we're getting another plant for sure. And we'll grab the squash seeds. Oh my gosh, there's more. 
Oh, more plants. What do I want to get rid of? Iron. Grab these. We got to get more plants. Wow, this is like some really good loot. Oh, no, I want to explore more. <laughs> Come on. We have so many plants now. We can create so much oxygen. We're doing it. We are going to do it. Let's see. Veggie 2. Oh, we need lots of ice. Jeez. Okay, let's put our aluminum away. And we're putting this uranium in there. Because we do not want to lose that. Base food. We'll put it away. Also, we have this Agility Boost T1. Increase displacement speed. So I think this lets us run faster. Yeah, definitely. Let's see. Oh yeah, it definitely does. Without a doubt. 15% faster. Heck yeah. Very nice. So we need lots of ice. Where can we get ice? You know, I have not explored over this direction like at all, so I'm gonna go do that. Actually, you know what? I see a lot of ice already. And we are getting all of this ice because we're gonna craft a lot of those veggie tubes to get more oxygen to unlock more blueprints. Okay, so silicon and magnesium. Of course we're out of silicon! Dang it! Alright, I'm going to go harvest a bunch of that. We'll just stick this in there for now. Ay ay ay. Alright, we have plenty of stuff now. Put some of those away. And that away. Okay, so we need magnesium. Grab a few of those. And now we can craft after we grab some ice. Ice. Where'd I put it? Right here. I need more inventory space. <laughs> put some of those away for now. Grab some of these. There we go. Finally, we are ready to put our plants. Oh, now we're out of power. <laughs> oh, man. Every time. It just never ends. <laughs> okay, I'm going to put the rest of these down. Because we need... We need more oxygen. Man. We should have seen that coming. More iron. We'll get the hang of this. Okay, I think four is all we had. We'll do that. And we're gonna put this plant in there. This plant. Whoa. This plant in there. This one in there. This one in there. And now we have to go craft another... Where is it? Where is it? Solar. So we need iron, cobalt, and aluminum. So one aluminum. Two cobalt. One iron. Okay. This should power everything up. This should be enough, I hope. Let's see here. Okay, are we up and running now? Go check it out. Okay, they're all four running. We have tons of oxygen coming in now. Let's look at our stats here. Oxygen is at 15. Yeah, it's moving up really fast. So our next upgrade for oxygen is going to be the Veggie Tube Tier 3. That's going to be a lot of grinding, I'm sure, to get that. But it's going to produce even more oxygen. And then that looks like it's the last for the oxygen category. That's it. We just have the, these three here. And then, let's see some of these. They keep going for a while. But the oxygen category just has seven spots, and then we have the last upgrade for the heater, and then the last upgrade for the or the oh never mind, this is something new. Place a seed in this to grow flowers on a small area out. Oh, that's how we get the grass and all the stuff. 
So you'll put it out here and it'll start growing. Oh my god, I'm so excited for that. So yes, we definitely need to work on our oxygen because that is at 150 points and we're, oh, oh my gosh, we're only at 15. Woo, we have a ways to go. We have a ways to go on that. That's still uh, super cool. Hopefully this veggie tube will progress this light. Oh, it's 13 oxygen a second. And the one we're using now is... Only 1.2. So yeah, the veggie tube will be 13 times one of these. That's insane. And plus, I think if you have a different plant, like this one has an oxygen multiplier of 150. And then this one is like just the base. And then there's another one that has 200%. Which is this one right here. Alright, so we have some good stuff. I think we're at another stopping point here. Because we're just waiting for our stats to get up. And um, yeah, I'm going to leave this running for a while. That way we get some more unlocks. And I'm also going to do some farming off screen to refill my chest. So I'm not constantly running out there. And then we will pick it up from there on episode 3 and hopefully get some grass growing. I hope. I don't know if we can make it that far, but I hope we can on uh, episode 4 actually. Thank you guys so much for stopping by. I super appreciate it. And we just saw, we just unlocked a new locker. So that's a bigger chest I'm pretty sure. So thank you again guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And I will catch you on episode 4.